YouTubers. Thanks for joining me. I'm Terry Edmonds. Uh, we are here in my shoe shop, If This Shoe Fits, in Maui, Hawaii. See the link there. And uh, today I'm going to be doing a quick review of uh, some Allen Edmonds. I have, uh, I am also a shoe repair and a cobbler, so I had a client come in and wanted to, uh, you know, just uh, spruce up his collection of Allen Edmonds. And I've done a video on Allen Edmonds of how to take care of them, which I recommend because these shoes are all about $350 for you uh, connoisseurs of Allen Edmonds. You know, the prices are up there, so you might as well take care of them as soon as you get them. Spend a little bit more. So click this link right here. That'll take you to the video and show you how I would recommend it. In the meantime, just for a little tune-up on the shoes, uh, I, prov I did a little bit of polishing. Some cream wax and some Lincoln stain wax. Uh, Meltonian and uh, Lincoln. They're two of the top of the line products that I'd recommend and they are available on my Amazon shopping cart on my website, terryedmonds.com. So feel free to uh, click there and have you know, the collection sent to you. I also did a video on how to choose the right color for your polish. Some of them are very special. So starting with this one. You know, this is the uh, loafer, actually. Uh, this one here, uh, very, uh, you have to be very careful with the colors that you choose to put a polish on this, so go light. This loafer from Allen Edmonds was nice. It's already been resold once. I can see it's a half sole and heel. And um, it is resolable, which is awfully nice. That's one thing I like. All leather linings, leather insoles. They've actually had a new insole put in. This client even had a heel back put on. So um, we did that quite a while ago. And it's nice because it protects the heels. He had worn holes through the heels. So there's a nice loafer from them. Um, another loafer from Allen Edmonds is this one. This is gorgeous. This is the Foley. And boy, this was yummy. I looked this up online and it comes in some other colors. I mean, if I was a guy and could buy dress shoes, I'd probably pick something like this. I really love this woven detail on here. Um, as I was polishing it, you know, you really get up close with it. And just the detail on the stitching for anybody who makes shoes or has any clue about what it takes to make a garment or something, you just see this, the piping and the exactness that they've done with this uh, additional piece of leather on here. It is quite stunning. This is a stitch down technology, meaning that this shoe can be repaired. Um, it has not had anything done to it yet. I can see some of the stitches will be coming out. So in my other video, I always recommend put a topi half sole so that you don't wear through the shoe. Why? It's got beautiful structure to it. Once you start cutting into it, you know, it's just not the same. Anyway, uh, so then we're moving on to, well, this one was fun too. I haven't put the shoelaces back in yet. And uh, this is called the, um, I'm sorry about that. This was the Humstead. And look at that gorgeous weave. Now this one to me, if you look up here, uh, so very close. I mean, trying to put this weave and a finished edge that won't come apart through the wear and the life of the shoe. I mean, these shoes last so long. Um, I'm just stunned. And you know, Allen Edmonds is made in America. I They have longtime employees that have worked for them. It's a great company and the artwork, they've just really got it down. I think the company started in 1922. Um, anyway, uh, moving on to some lace-ups, some other lace-ups. This one's gorgeous. This is the um, Hershey. And it's kind of similar. They um, got still have that weave in here. The detail is beautiful. This Hershey comes in so many beautiful colors. Just going to their website and strolling through their colors is really fun. Again, fully repairable. He is wearing through his stitches and he's gonna need a new heel and he'll be coming back for that. So anyway, um, we'll do a, probably do a leather half sole it's wearing through here. But again, you know, for a full shoe, um, it's not too heavy. And I'm impressed with that because when you put, start doing full leather soles, heavy heels like this, they can get heavy. Um, but they're not. And this one's pretty much a classic. Uh, this is the McAllister and this one, again, they offer it in five different colors. Um, still pretty lightweight for all the layers of leather that you have on there. Um, the detailing is absolutely stunning. We put round dress laces in there. Um, again, fully repairable. 
And let's see, this is another one that they came out with. And there, it this one is, um, it is repairable. I wouldn't want to because it's such a pain in the neck. These rubber soles, you have to heat gun them off. And honestly, for having a rubber sole on here, it's heavy. I'm, I don't know, I'm not impressed. It does have, um, you know, some, what do I think about this shoe? It's heavy. I'm not a big fan. Still Allen Edmonds though. Now something else that I love is this shoe here, the Lugano. Uh, the Lugano is lovely. Look at that loafer. I mean, it's just so simple. They do have some, a uh, little bit of elastic here in the top to give it some extra uh, comfortable wear. And um, just your basic loafer, but gosh, super light. You know, of course, every Allen Edmonds comes with the leather lining, leather insoles, and this is a full leather sole. It has not been stitched down, so basically when we repair it, we would take this off halfway, put a new leather sole on it, and um, fairly easy to repair. So I really like this. I think a lot of my customers who happen to be, I have a lot of elderly gentlemen, um, although this guy's not young who bought this. He's pretty sassy and he's got nice style. Uh, but anyway, I love it. I think it's nice and uh, it's a great shoe. So price point, I about, you know, really, you're not looking, you can't really get much under 250 when you buy it brand new um, from Allen Edmonds, but some of these are 350, 360. I did notice you can get a couple of things on eBay uh, for about $80, $90. It's tough to buy shoes online, so I would say that Allen Edmonds runs with a very medium width, not narrow and not wide. And so there we have it. Thank you so much for joining me. This was fun because I really like Allen Edmonds and the quality, and um, I appreciate you watching. So remember, we've got other videos on how to uh, extend the life of your shoes, how to polish, how to select a good polish. And if you have any questions, you could always ask me in the comments down below. Thanks so much for joining. Terry Edmonds coming to you again. Remember to subscribe and aloha.